So once again, everyone, I just want to say hi to everyone and thanks for joining me and connecting with me today. It's so good to be with all of you. So as you can see, my scenery is a little bit different today. I'm sure you can see some of the, the bush here behind me. So I'm actually connecting with you from northern KZN here in South Africa. So we had a family funeral this side of, 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 of town. And of course, we had to travel down on the weekend just to come and support our family here. So we decided that we were going to just, you know, stay a little bit longer and just make sure that we attend to all the needs on this side. So it's also really awesome to connect with you today because I also had my birthday earlier this week. So thank you to all of you who wished me a happy birthday. I really do appreciate it. Thanks for taking the time to wish me. It was on the 3rd of August, for those of you who don't know, but to everyone who did take the time to wish me, thank you so much. I do appreciate it. And I must just say it was really awesome, you know, because we're in a national lockdown, of course, it was really awesome just being here in Northern KZN and just waking up to the scenery. It's always so peaceful for us to come this side. We've got a family home here. So it's always so awesome just to come here and just spend, you know, a few days away from Johannesburg, all the hustle and the bustle, you know, in Johannesburg and just get to relax and really just enjoy the environment this side. So it's awesome to be connecting with you from Northern KZN today. So ladies and gentlemen, I am here to share with you that we've got our upcoming SME Global Virtual entrepreneurial and investing summit that's coming up from the 22nd to the 23rd of august so if you haven't registered yet you need to make sure that you get yourselves registered on this event as i mentioned to you last week we are very very excited you know as sme women it's really been our custom over the last few years to host various entrepreneurial events and of course this year due to a national lockdown here in south africa we had to cancel all our, all of our events for 2020 but nevertheless the there is, of course, an opportunity to do a lot of work online, and we've been taking full advantage of that opportunity. So we will be hosting our first global event this year. And in fact, this will be our first global virtual event. So we're very, very excited about it. We really have a lot of awesome speakers that will be participating and sharing with you at the summit. And today, I just want to spend some time, you know, just to take you through our schedule as far as, as the summit is concerned. So I just wanna make sure for those of you who haven't had the opportunity yet, we will be posting the link in this chat, chat box. So please make sure that you register via the link. It's really easy to register. You just click on the link and you know, you'll be able to go straight onto the registration site and, and that's where you'll be able to just register yourself onto the event. And for those of you who are also following us across our social media platforms, whether it's my Candice Van Bake platform or on SME Women, you're also able to register directly from, from our social media platform. So please make sure that you get yourselves regist registered on the event. You don't want to miss this event. Now, ladies and gentlemen, so yes, it is an SME Women initiative, but we are inviting and we are welcoming both males and females to the summit. So if you are an entrepreneur, if you are looking to get started in business, some of you have had a lot of awesome ideas and maybe you're not quite sure how to move some of those ideas forward, I do encourage you, come register yourself, get yourself registered onto the summit and you would be able to really get some awesome insights and information that would be able to help you move those ideas forward and of course also take your business to the next level. We are in a time today where we need to become more innovative, we need to become more creative in terms of how we are moving our business goals and our business dreams forward. And yes, it is a difficult time. We have seen a lot of businesses close down over this period. We've seen people lose some of their salaries. In fact, you know, some people have lost all of their salaries. Some people have been retrenched. Some people are going through that. But really, I don't want you to be discouraged and feel like this is the end of you. I do believe for if you are listening today and you have been affected negatively by the impact of COVID-19, then I want you to know that there is an opportunity for you to move forward and there is still an opportunity for you to realize your dreams. So it is an entrepreneurial and investing summit. So we're also gonna be sharing with you new business opportunities that you can possibly also pursue at this time. So for those of you who are maybe not in business, but you know that you've reached a stage in your life where you need to find alternatives, you know, whether it's just looking for an additional stream of income, 
or maybe you are looking to supplement some of the income that's been lost, then I do encourage you to get yourself onto the summit and we'll be sharing some awesome information with you as far as business is concerned, as far as property is concerned, and also as far as new strategies are concerned to generate additional income. So just to share with you, so the event will kick off on the 22nd of August and it will be starting at 8.30. Now also just to share with you, at 8.30 we will have the introduction to the summit and I will be your host on the summit. So I'm also the founder of SME Woman and I will be your host for the summit. But I wanna share with you, for those of you who will be attending the entire summit, so from start, from 8.30 all the way to the Sunday, we've got sessions every single day. And of course we make sure that you do have a half an hour break in between. So it won't be back to back sessions that will be taking place. You will have have a little bit of a break just to refresh and get yourself ready for the next session. But for those of you who are who will be attending all of the sessions, ladies and gentlemen, we've got amazing giveaways that we will be giving to, to you right at the end of the summit. So please make sure that you participate, that you attend every summit and the giveaways will only be made available to those who are attending you know, every session that will be taking place at our Global Virtual Summit from the 22nd to the 23rd of August. So after we've had our, our welcome session and our introduction session at 8.30, then of course we will have our first speaker for the, for the summit and I will be your first speaker. So I will get right into my talk. And this year, what I'm going to be talking about is that I'm going to talk to you about, it's time to reveal your glory, your light, your greatness. And I really believe that, ladies and gentlemen, we are living in an opportune time. There's a lot of opportunities. I believe a lot of you have dreams and, and desires on the inside of you that need to be revealed. And I really believe that now is that opportunity. Now is that time for you to really reveal who you are and also what you've been called to do. So I believe each and every one of you has gifting and I'm going to be sharing with you how you are able to tap into your purpose, how you are able to tap into your gifting and also how you are able to use that to your benefit and make sure that you transform every sing every area of your life so in the areas of business in the areas of property and also in every other area of your life so you will be getting some good information and insights that i will be sharing with you in terms of how you too can go out and pursue your dreams and pursue your goals and make a success of it because now is that time for you to really pursue that and really love out who you were called to be i believe each and every one of us was born with a purpose god has gifted us with purpose and he's gifted us with dreams and now is the time for you to really love out your purpose and to pursue your dreams. So get yourselves registered onto the event. And of course, you will be able to get some more information and insights as I share with you in terms of how you are able to move forward in every single area of your lives, including business and property. And then after that, we have our next speaker who will be coming up. And I'm also doing an amazing interview with her this Friday as part of our Reflections Live broadcast. So I will be interviewing the amazing Noreen Makasiwe. So she will be joining me. She's originally from Kenya, but she currently resides in the UK. And that's also where she runs her business from. And we're going to be having an awesome interview this Friday. But just to give you a little bit of insights, just in terms of what, no what Noreen will be talking about. So at our summit that will be coming up, from the 22nd to the 23rd, her session will be taking place at straight after my session. So we will have a little bit of a break. So, and then her session will kick off at 10 o'clock and she will be sharing with you how to sell your expertise with clarity and with confidence. So that's what she's going to be covering at the summit. So she's going to be sharing with you how you are able to clearly communicate value proposition that connects, convinces, and converts prospects into clients or partners, okay? And she's really going to be just digging deep and sharing some good tips and strategies that you can use and help you to craft your, your preposition during these difficult times. And of course, as you know, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to have to make sure that we become a lot, we become a lot more innovative and creative in terms of how we are positioning ourselves in the market at this time. So she's very successful. I'll be sharing. We're going to be discussing all of her amazing achievements and accolades that she's received over the many years that she's been in business. She's an international strategy advisor, tech inclusion advocate, and keynote speaker. 
and she's she also heads up the Radical Leap Company, and she's also passionate about empowering entrepreneurs and especially women entrepreneurs in the areas of business. So we will be talking to we will be spending more time with Noreen this Friday. And then, of course, after Noreen, we've got another amazing speaker. And some of you have had the opportunity to also listen to our interview that we did some time back. So I interviewed also the, the phenomenal Zola Tekiso. She's the CEO and founder of Great Seed Talent. And she will be talking about the power of prioritizing, how to actually maximize your time. And, you know, I've spent a lot of time with entrepreneurs over the last couple of months, and especially being in lockdown, it's been very difficult for a lot of entrepreneurs to really pursue all of their business goals at this time. Why? Because they are finding it really hard to just manage all of the responsibility that has come with homeschooling, also doing, you know, work and business from their personal residence and, and all of those other things that we have to manage as, as also part of our home responsibilities. So I think it's very important at this time that we also learn the power of prioritizing and how to manage our time more effectively. And I know a lot of you that have spoken to me in the past, you are having challenges in this area. So make sure that you get yourselves registered onto the summit. Click on the registration link that's made available in the, in the chat box. And you will be able to learn how you are able to prioritize more effectively and how you are able to maximize your time to make sure that you move all of your goals forward successfully. Because that's really what it's important. If we've got all of the goals, but we don't know how to prioritize and manage those goals, then of course, we're not going to really achieve any level of success in our lives. So it's also important for us to know how to maximize you know, our time and make sure that we, we really become more successful in prioritizing and, and, max, and managing the time that's made available to us. Because each and every person, ladies and gentlemen, has been gifted with the same amount of time but we are all using it differently. Some people have been able to move forward successfully. And of course, some people have had some challenges in the area of moving some of the goals forward. So come and listen to Zola's talk and let her help you manage some of those challenges in that particular area. And then of course, we have our next phenomenal speaker. And this is Pastor Natasha Van Tonder. And some of you may have also heard her as she has also you know, hosted various events and particip participated in various summits and events over the years. And I'm very excited to have her as part of our speaker panel for our SME Women Summit. She's not only a pastor, but she's also an author and she's a leadership trainer and she's training facility, sorry, she's a leadership training facilitator of Lockdown International. And she's really very passionate about uplifting people. And she's also very passionate about equipping people also in the areas of business, in the areas of ministry, whatever it is that you are doing today. She's passionate about helping people to also take action and how to, how to pursue, how, how to help people take action and help them to move some of those goals forward. So her topic for the summit will be just do stop procrastination. Now, I don't know if many of you know, but the biggest factor of failure that has been identified is procrastination. So I've done various events also over the last couple of years and I've asked this question often. And a lot of times people will come to me and they'll say to me that the number one influence factor of failure is fear. And yes, fear is also a factor, but the number one influencing factor is procrastination. And that means not taking action. So you have all of these dreams, you have all of these goals, you wanna have a more successful 2020, that you want this year to be more successful than last year but of course you find yourself in a position where you are not taking action and you are not moving your goals forward so Natasha Fantonder will be sharing on how to stop procrastinating and how to take action so get yourselves registered on the event and you will be encouraged you will be motivated you will be inspired and you will be equipped in terms of how you are able to overcome the behavior of procrastination and get yourselves onto the right track so that you can start taking action. Because ladies and gentlemen, in order for us to become successful in life, we're going to have to do something and we're going to have to take action. No action, no results. So it's important also to be equipped in the area of how you can overcome. So some of you may feel that you've been going through a stage or phase in your lives where you have feel like you've been procrastinating and you haven't been able to really achieve a lot during these times. And of course, now is going to be the opportunity 
to surround yourself with the right people, with positive people, with successful people, with people who are experts in their various fields. And they've been able to help many people over the last couple of years overcome some of these challenges so that they can be successful in life, in business, as well as in property and every other strategy that you may be pursuing today. And then, of course, we also have the amazing Nsiki Mikize. I also did a Reflections interview with her not so long ago. And for those of you who don't know her, she's a social entrepreneur. She's also a speaker. She's an author. She's, she's authored her first book already. And she's also a presenter. And she was our second princess for our Miss South Africa 2015 pageant. So she's, got, she's a woman with many giftings and talents. And she will be talking about the power of mentorship. And I think that is such an important topic in today's life because it's so important to make sure that we also have mentors and coaches in our lives. I personally have my own mentors and coaches in my lives. I'm currently also busy with a coaching program. For those of you who don't know, I've shared it as part of our, our, our summit communications. I'm also being coached by the world renowned. And I believe that uh, he's really the best inspirational and motivational speaker that I've listened to. And I'm being coached by him and I'm sure many of you know him. It's the amazing Les Brown and I'm being coached by him also in the areas of, 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 of pursuing my purpose and in speaking and all these wonderful things that I'm working on at the moment. So I encourage you come and learn about the power of mentorship. We will also be sharing with you some opportunities in terms of how you are able to get your own mentor, how you're able to get your own coach in the areas of business, in the areas of property. For those of you who are also looking for amazing mentors and, and, and coaches to work with. So it's very important to make sure that we learn from other people who are doing who, who have been successful and who are successfully doing what we want to do. And I've also discovered in my journey that one of the quickest ways for us to achieve our goals and our dreams and to achieve great success is by learning from other people. So that is why this is also a very important topic. So register for our event, get yourself onto the event, and you'll be able to learn about that. And then, of course, ladies and gentlemen, on the 20. Second, and this will be our last session for the day, we will also have the amazing, amazing Oliver Grimbley who will be joining us. So he is our guest speaker. He is our special guest speaker for this event. And ladies and gentlemen, you are going to be blown away by the message that he will be sharing with you. So he's an entrepreneur, he's a business strategist, and he's also a speaker. And just to give you, just to share a little bit with you, just in terms of who Oliver is. So he's a former professional athlete turned entrepreneur. The fields in which he spe specializes are marketing, sales, networking, and, and human behavior. So shortly after working as an international business strategist and speaker for some of the world's most, for some of the world's leading business coaches, Oliver pioneered a company into Africa and globally that became a billion dollar brand in just six years. So two short years later, he became a seven figure earner and now mentors and teaches over, over 10,000 entrepreneurs around the world, teaching them how they can live a, their, live a lifestyle by design. So he's going to be talking to you about how you are actually the benefits. In fact, he's going to be talking to you about the benefits of building an online or e-commerce business in the current economy. So ladies and gentlemen, a very, very important topic. And I think it's really important that each and every one of you registers for our summit and that you come and attend this amazing, this amazing, this amazing talk as well. So that covers it then for for the, for the 23rd, for the 22nd. And then of course we move into the 23rd. We'll also have a session starting at nine o'clock on the 23rd. Vangile Makwakwa will be joining us. And you've also listened to my last interview that I had with her. So she will be talking to us about the seven emotions that stop us from expanding financially and increasing our income. She's very passionate about helping people to achieve financial success she is the founder of Wealth Money, and she also hosts um, she also hosts her her podcast, which is called Property Magician. She is the co-host of that particular podcast, 
and she will be sharing with you at the summit the seven emotions that stop us from expanding financially and increasing income and how you are able to overcome these emotions that that stop you from achieving great financial success so she's also got an amazing story for those of you who missed our our talk in July, please go and listen to it on our YouTube channel. We'll make our YouTube channel also available in the chat box. And you can also listen to the previous video that I've, I've done with her. And then also after that, we will have also the amazing Leroy Slava. And I'm sure many of our South Africans in the area of property know him very well. So he was also one of the finalists for the Invest of the Year Big Leagues Award last year. And he will be talking to us about how to prosper through property in difficult times. Now, Leroy initially just started, you know, his property investing journey just by focusing on, on, on the sheriff's auctions and buying a lot of properties from the sheriff's auctions within a short period of time. So he learned the, the, the skill and the strategy of buying properties at the right prices and being able to sell them within a shorter period of time. And he became very successful th through that strategy. And of course, he's progressed to into different strategies. He now owns residential buildings. He also owns multi-let properties. And he's going to be sharing with you how you are able to prosper through property in difficult times. So whether you are already in property or whether you are wanting to get started in property, doesn't matter whether you are based in South Africa or in a different country, you will be able to use these principles and you will be able to apply it to your area. So whichever area you are residing in today, you will be able to take these concepts, you'll be able to take these principles, the information that you will be learning here, and you'll be able to apply it to your particular area. Now, I really believe that every entrepreneur should be pursuing property as an investment strategy. And that is why one of our key focus as part of SME Women is property. And you'll always find that we will always be talking about property at our events as well, because it's so important for entrepreneurs during these times to make sure that you start pursuing property as an invest as an investment strategy to start generating healthy profit income every month as well as be in a position to generate large sums of money through the various capital strategies that are available in property so he will be talking to you about that so just to share with you some of the the the, the, the topics that he will or the the areas that he will be focusing on as part of his topic. So he'll be talking about the creative strategies that you are able to pursue at this time in the area of property investing. He'll talk to you about, this, about the mistakes that most property investors make and how you are able to overcome and, and avoid some of those mistakes. And then he'll also talk to you about how to overcome fear during COVID-19 times. And I think this is such an important topic. Or, or, or topic that he will be covering as part of his his overall talk. So I think very, very important. And I think a fear is, fear is holding a lot of people back at this time. And ladies and gentlemen, I've learned that one of the best ways to overcome fear is to make sure that you get the right, the right level of knowledge and information. And that's one of the ways that we are able to overcome fear. So once you get the right information, once you get the right level of knowledge, once you start surrounding yourself with like-minded people, with positive people, with people who are more successful than you, you will find that you will be able to overcome some of these factors and these elements that are trying to hold you back, including fear and procrastination, and you will be able to overcome those things during, during these times. And then also you'll talk about why this is a perfect time to invest in property, and we'll also talk to you about how to analyze a good deal, how to analyze a bad deal, how to wrap the numbers, and then also the seven golden rules of property investing and then how to take the, the, the leap from small deals into big deals. So as I said, we started with smaller deals and is now moving to residential developments. And obviously, we'll be able to share with you how you was able to take that jump from smaller deals moving into the big deals. So really, as you can hear, we really have a jam-packed session for you as far as this particular talk is concerned as well. And then we'll move right into Amanda Woodward's, Woodward's talk. She's, based, she's from the UK. And she will be talking to you about how to get paid in pounds and live in your local currency through property. So just imagine that, how to get paid in pounds and then enjoy that in your local currency, whatever your local currency is today. So the, the, prop, the UK property market has really opened up opportunities to international investors. So whether you are from South Africa, whether you are from Sri Lanka, whether you are from the United States of America, it doesn't matter where you find yourself today, whether you are from Kenya or Namibia, any part of the world, there's an opportunity for you as an international investor to get started 
through by investing in property in the UK market, in the United Kingdom market. And she'll be talking to you about how you are able to take advantage of the opportunities that have been made available to international investors at this time. And not only will she be able to share information with you, but she'll also be able to share with you how you can tap into the right teams that will be able to help you. Because ladies and gentlemen, we no longer need to reside in the countries where we are investing in. I also branched into international investing two years ago. And I can tell you that you don't have to be residing in that particular company, uh, sorry, in that particular country in order to, to, to take advantage of the opportunities in the market. So once you understand how to get the right systems in place, how to get the right power teams in place and how to leverage the systems and the power teams that you put in place, then of course it really becomes easier for us to be able to move our property goals forward. So she's gonna be talking to us about how international investors are able to get started in property. And for those of you who don't know, please go and read her bio also on our, our summit page as far as the, the, the registration page is concerned. And you'll be able to see the amazing work that she's done. She's really become very successful through property. In fact, she used to be in a full-time corporate role. And of course she, she resigned from that. And she's now property has become her main investment strategy and she, she does it on a full-time basis. So she's no longer exchanging time for money. In fact, her money is now working for her and she's become financially independent through property. So she'll be sharing some awesome insights with you. And then of course, we also have a panel discussion which will be taking place at half past two on the 23rd. And this is just an opportunity that we've made available to you. So for those of you who will have additional Q&A questions, this is a good time for you to connect with us and really just get some insights on some of the topics that have been covered. So make sure you attend each and every single session. Remember, for those of you who will be doing that, we really have amazing giveaways that we will be making available to you. And then, of course, we end our conference at half past three on the 23rd. We will be talking about the next steps because we want to make sure that you are fully equipped as part of SME Women. We don't just want to host events and then we walk away. We want to make sure that you are in a position where you have the right level of support and you know what your next steps are in terms of where you are. So I'm sure all of you will want to take some of this information and you will want to use it and, and move some of your goals forward, your business goals, your property goals, your financial goals, whatever goals you have today, you will want to be in a position where you can successfully move those goals forward. So don't miss out on the last session that we will have at half past three, where we will be talking about the next steps and how you can you know, just take all of the learnings, take all of the insights and how you can successfully move that forward. And of course, we're also going to be talking to you about exciting and upcoming developments that we're also working on as part of SME Women, making sure that we're always bringing value to our SME community and also making sure that you are in a stronger position to be able to grow your small to medium sized business and also to achieve your financial goals. So ladies and gentlemen, that really covers it. I hope that I've been able to share some insights with you just in terms of our upcoming SME Women's Summit. Remember that you need to register. The registration link will be made available for you if it's not made available already. Get yourselves registered on the event. Make sure that you share it with as many people as possible. Every single person who is looking for new ways and new ideas of generating income, you need to get yourself registered onto the summit because you will be learning about new ways, additional ways that you can pursue that will be able to help you generate additional income. So whether you are an entrepreneur, whether you are a property investor, remember it's important for us to make sure that we put in place multiple streams of income and you will be learning about some other ways that you are able to generate additional streams of income. So thank you so much for taking the time to connect with me and thank you so much for, for participating today. If you've got any questions, please do put it into the chat box and we'll make sure that we answer all of those questions. And I just want to double check and make sure that I haven't missed any questions from our live chat. So thanks to those of you who've shared some comments, just saying that it's a wonderful message. Awesome. I'm happy to hear that. And just thank you for connecting with us. So make sure that you register for the summit, ladies and gentlemen. It is our first SME woman global virtual entrepreneurial and investing summit and this year we want to make sure that as part of our sme woman initiative we want to make sure that we help you go from glory to glory 
in every area of your lives, including in the areas of business and property. So thank you so much for your time. And I will see you on Friday when I interview the amazing Noreen. See, she is one of our summit speakers. So please do connect with us on Friday at one o'clock and you'd be able to really hear her business journey and how she's been able to start her business and really move it to a level of great success. And we'll be talking about all her amazing achievements and accolades that she's received and how she's been able to really achieve some of those awesome achievements in her business journey. So don't forget to connect with us on Friday and I look forward to connecting with you all then. So thank you so much for your time and God bless you all. Goodbye.